Hey everybody, Tally from SharpRo.com. I got a review here for the um, Griffin Survivor Series case here. I've been meaning to do this review for a while now. This is the Survivor case here for the iPad 2 as well as the iPad 3. Um, it's a really nice um, case. It, it works great for what it is. Um, got to shut that off. But um, I'll go ahead and give you kind of a tour around it. You see right here, you got your home button. Now, if I go ahead and focus the camera for us, you got your home button with a nice little Griffin logo on it. Below that, below that is the dock connector right there. As well, you got a, uh, there should be a, as your speaker port right there that covers up nicely. As well as that goes off to the side right there and snaps there. Doesn't really do it that well. That's one thing I don't like about that. It's supposed to snap in there, but it really doesn't. On top here, you got your Griffin logo. Sorry about the lighting, guys. I'm trying my best here. Very top, you got another little thing here, and that is for your microphone. Right here, this would be for your camera. Corn pull it back. These are kind of hard to pull back, but for the protection that this thing gives you, it's really nice. I would throw this off the building and not have any problem with it. You see what I mean? It's hard to. You have to really dig your fingernails in there, and they try to give you that that nub right there to pull on but in my opinion it doesn't work at all you got your camera right there and you got your sleep wake button on top right there i fix that for us and then right here is the um, sleep wake button as well as your volume controls and on top you have a place for a camera on the side yeah here I got that part on the bottom here this is a stand right here and you see right here, it's a nice stand. Uh, I've had this case for probably about um, maybe two months now, and this stand did decide to break. And you see right there, it did break. Um, I don't, I didn't order this directly from, from Griffin, so I don't have a, re, a um, warranty on it. But um, it's still, anyways, it's it's nice. To, I can't really use a stand, but if I think about it, I can actually take the stand off now because I'm not going to use it anymore. But it's a really nice stand. You can see it. it went, if it was working right, it would stand up just like that. And you got a good viewing angle. And so it's a nice stand, but only if it works correctly. And I noticed on this stand, this is something they can improve on uh, just the build quality and that the little f rubber feet came off within a week of using that. So that's something I would recommend uh, fixing on that. But other than that, it's a very durable case. You got a good shock protection, good corner protection on your desk. You see right there. It's a really good protection. Um, I really enjoyed this case and I highly recommend it for anybody wanting a good solid case. And this case does, I definitely think it protects the, um, it protects the iPad much better than the uh, Autobox Defender case because the Autobox case does not have a screen protector and this does and I've had kids playing on this, I've had rocks thrown on this it's a really protective case, it's dust proof, water resistant, shock proof and all that and I highly recommend it for what it is. If you have any questions about this go ahead and leave a comment as well and I'll try to answer the best I can but go ahead and subscribe if you want to know when I have more videos out and I'll see you guys in the next